Welcome back to our channel, Fast Cabling Civilians Enthusiasts. Navigating through the intricacies of network video recorders can be a bit overwhelming, but fear not that in this video, we're simplifying the complex and bringing you a comprehensive tutorial on network video recorder operation. So our network video recorders play a pivotal role in modern video civilian system, providing a centralized and advanced solution for storing, managing, and retrieving civilian footage. NVRs leverage digital network for enhanced functionality and efficiency. The primary purpose of NVR is to capture, process, and store video footage from IP camera over an Ethernet network. This centralized approach simplified the management of civilian system, allowing users to monitor and control multiple cameras from a single interface. And by embracing digital technologies, NVRs offer superior image quality, scalability, and advanced features. Their centralized management and compatibility with IP cameras make them a cornerstone in a contemporary security system, providing users with powerful tools to ensure the safety and security of their environments. And the core components of NVR system encompass cameras, network connections, and storage solution, and each playing a vital role in seamless operation of the civilian network. IP cameras serve as the eyes of the system, capturing high-definition video footage. These cameras are connected to the NVR through an Ethernet network, ensuring a fast and reliable data transfer. And NVRs typically come equipped with built-in storage or have provision for external storage devices like hard drives. And configuring the storage setting involves specifying the parameters such as recording quality duration and retention policies. So now we're in front of the demonstration board. And as you can see, the bullet camera and the dome-shaped camera are already connected with our network video recorder through this WebSmart PoE switch. And next, I'm going to show you all the magics within the NVR system. So in the live view section, you can see a real-time feed from the camera. The cameras may be grouped or displayed individually. You can choose the split menu, it depends on how many cameras do you have. And right-click it, we can see the user interface. It is designed to provide a user-friendly experience, allow you to access various menu settings and features. Let's go to the main menu and we'll walk through the key aspect of the NVR interface to help you navigate seamlessly. This is the playback menu. It allows you to review recorded footage. And you can select a specific date or time and choose the cameras and playback recorded video. This is the camera channel. Let's just select number two and a date. and it has video footage displaying already. And this green bar means it's regular, the red one means it attacked movement. You can see there's someone passing by. And you can pause it, you can play it fast forward and backward. And you can take control of your playback. So let's stop playing, going back out. And we can access the setting menu, right click it. This is the IPC. It allows you to change your camera's configurations and system preference. Here we have the image setting, the brightness, contrast, sharpness. This is the light setting. And also the resolution, the compression are over here. This is where you choose the quality. And you may find the option to adjust the video recording setting. Let's go back out. 
the main menu again. This is the record configuration. This NVR support alarm and notification include motion detection alert for specific event. So if you want to record video footage, only when it detects movement, you can click the box in here. This is the alarm. If not, you can just uncheck it and it will record video footage all the time. You can also set the time here. For example, if you're in an office working environment, maybe you want to record from 9 in the morning until 6 in the afternoon. Oops. This is how you can set it and just hit regular. And maybe if at night you want to start at 6 until morning and you can check detection and alarm so you can utilize the storage spaces. This is the length and you can also check for the channels that you want to configure. And last but not least, remote access is a key feature that significantly enhances the flexibility and convenience of managing your NVR system. With remote access capability, you can monitor your civilian system from anywhere in the world, providing peace of mind and real-time oversight. This is facilitated through dedicated mobile application and software on your computer that are designed to keep you connected it even when you're on the go. So using a mobile application compatible with your NVR system, you can access live camera feed, review recorded footage, and receive alert directly on your smartphone or tablet. This application often offers user-friendly interface, allowing you to navigate the different cameras with ease. Additionally, computer software can provide a similar level of remote monitoring allow you to access your network video recorder system through a web interface or a dedicated software on your desktop. Make sure you add a router so you have internet access for your NVR. So congratulations, you have just mastered the art of NVR operation. So now keep, you can keep your space secure with confidence. Thank you very much for joining us today and please don't forget to like, share and subscribe our channel Fast Cabling for more civilian tips and tutorial. And until next time, happy monitoring.